Hello beautiful somebody. In the last video we were coming out from Gough Estate and now we are going to proceed all the way down the road. <laughs> Over the flyover the bridge, down Alcorn Road into Woji Estate. So this is the exercise ground. When you come here most mornings, especially on Saturdays, mo Saturday mornings, you would see different groups of people exercising here. This is like our workout space and we just have different different names we have taekwondo people we have people that dance we have people that come to eat and gist we have people that come to push <laughs> people that come to lift weight people that come to play ball lawn tennis this sandy area is badminton sorry not lawn tennis badminton on the other side of the road also there are also people walking out so it's just lots of walking out and people running along this road or strolling along this road in the mornings yeah there's a video i uploaded of recently i was taking a stroll around here some people are wondering where was that asking me this is where it was <laughs> i think it still is but it used to be my favorite part of but i thought when i whenever i run on this place i stop where the water is and just take it in i wish i can actually find a picture i took of the water like in the morning the sun rising there is beautiful and yellow and i don't know it just feels like two different worlds the serenity of the water and then crazy trailers passing this bridge like some of them will literally vibrate like when you're standing there the the bridge will be vibrating with their lousy horns so it's just like very peaceful area on one side and then crazy traffic on your other side so i just used to find it really interesting <laughs> so we are going to go up over this flyover and if you're going to LLM1 Apwajo as I said you would go straight if you're going into Alcon Road you would go up and turn around and the turning around is really a turning around because you will turn for a while this flyover is interesting you just keep turning and turning and turning and turning and turning and turning and turning when you jog on this bridge or this flyover then you'll know that you walked out it is more intense than that flat road because this is like hill and goes down another hill and you know so we used to walk on this this flyover like five times <laughs> very lazy strolling with my friend we just stroll no we walk fast though we go down and go up and go down and go up like that and today we are tired so from 5 a.m you would see people strolling on that bridge or jogging whichever one suits them we are approaching the alcon company i got to know after this video that it is a construction company i used to think there is a jetty deal or something because there is a huge body of water and then sheaves and well i heard they are a construction company that's an anglican church a big one and i like this this is they sell center rugs, paintings, boxes, different types of mats. Um, what are what's those fire cylinder thing? Oh boy, what's those fire cylinder thing? Yeah. <laughs> I cannot remember what's that extinguisher, <laughs> fire extinguishers. Okay, so this is the Alcon Gate. We are coming up on there. So I know a very, very good teller who sews and delivers internationally. We're about to pass her, her store like, and she's amazing. If you have been struggling with bad Nigerian tellers, then just let me know. If I hook you up when you're satisfied, you're going to give me a shout out. Maybe say if you go shout out for money from because she sews so well. This is the first place I would see you test your clothes and one hand it will fit you perfectly. I've never had that experience with tailors before until her. So she's really amazing. This is her, her store. It's tailored by Ash. If you're interested, I will link you up for nothing. I'm not getting anything out of it, but I want you to testify with me. 
don't be thinking Nigerian tell us are this, Nigerian tell us are that. You've not yet found the good ones, and that's the link. So this is Zakozin Philly Station. Because I cover this road in my part two, I'm just going to zoom past it into Woji Estate. I want to show you Woji Estate. Okay, this alarm is saying it's time to sleep. Ooh, we're almost done. So. This is the Alcon Road. We are passing those car wash. I told you guys about car wash in Nigeria. They are like places to chill in the evening. Some of them turn into like a joint. So as you're washing your car, you'll be chilling with Ishiwu and Kobe and beer, watching football, gisting. That's where men go to wash their cars and have a nice time while washing their cars. But most of them know how to make very good pepper soup, catfish pepper soup. This is one. We just passed it. That's welcome you supermarket. Oh, we've already passed the other one too. We have two on this street. We just passed them. This is Mvigwe Junction. I covered it in my last vlog. That's the part two of my protocol vlogs. The next junction we'll be coming up on is the Woji Estate Junction. And that is where I want to briefly show you what it looks like. That's a very residential area, but every residential area that has any form of traffic is going to have businesses and shops around there. And I am going to show you that. So this is Alcon Road. We are very close to YKC roundabouts, but we are not going to get there. We are about to divert into Woji Estates. And here it is. So there is a major police station inside. Oh my damn. There is a there is a police station, the ZOG police station, OG Estate Police Station is just down the road. And we are not going to get to it. We are going to turn. Oh, this is OG Market. I don't know the market extend outside where the market is so. This is estate market, Woody estate market. Starting from the roadside shops, look at how fresh, how fresh those pineapples are. How beautiful they look delicious in the eyes. So, this leads you into Woody estate. As you can see, as I told you, this is a very residential place, but you know, every residential place that there is opportunity for business will have too much businesses because a lot of people are looking for what to do so oh guys i don't know what else to say you just have to look here and see we are going to pass this church we're going to pass the catholic church and when we get to like deep in the estates i will let you go i will love you and leave you just for now I hope at this point you have given this video a thumbs up. Please do. It helps my channel. Thank you. And guys, I hope this video in any way just makes you feel good. Yeah, please let me know if it does. Just leave a comment and say, oh, I miss this place. Thank you. Or, oh, I wanted to see what Pataka looks like. Thank you. Or, Oh, I have plans of visiting Nigeria and visiting Petekat. I'm going to try Belair, you know, like all those kind of things. So that's this school. I slowed it down enough for you to see the name. So we're good. We are good. We are good. So these are residents, residentials residential houses but with oh that's the holy family catholic church woji estate woji holy family catholic church okay and it's finer than this 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 pathway it's way finer than this pathway so not the outside and this just leads into residential residential this are like average residential areas in nigeria 
everybody with their gates and Kaka to take you inside oh god guys I'm tired I am tired and I think like you should have you don't be left full you suppose don't be left full with this level of showing I brought you home <laughs> I showed you around <laughs> she'll be tired for now so guys you can watch my other vlog videos I'm going to take you to GRA old GRA where you have all the court houses and I, I I'm also going to take you to Portacourt town like old town that place is like the the heart of old Portacourt <laughs> look out for those videos guys please take care of yourself and see you next time